Hello. Today we're going to talk about the process of building prompts and keeping prompts. And if you're like me and most of my team, you'll get into chat GPT, you're going to town, and I spent a few minutes to make up the process so that you can understand it. But we started with that you're a social media expert chat. We're going to write some fun but professional SEO content. content. And it's always good to ask chat, do you understand? Okay. He says, absolutely. And then I say, I would like a paragraph based on the topic that you prompt me for. And so notice here, first, chat's not doing a very good job. The benefits of remote work. Well, that's an interesting topic. But I said, no, you need to ask me the topic. Okay, great. And... It gives this topic, importance of sustainable fashion. Still not what I want. So, of course, I'm working with chat. Uh, just ask me a topic. Do not make any recommendations. So now we're starting to get where I want. So what topic would you like me to write on? Benefits from working home. Great. So we have our paragraph. And then the normal flow for most people is they're like, okay, well, what's the next thing I want? So I tell it, well, I would like to add a topic that includes emojis. And so it provides this topic first and then an article. And I don't like this. Right? So I tell it, no, I want you to request the topic, right? Because I want to be able to prompt, give it what I want. And so then I ask it again if it understands. I give it a topic. So now it generates... And I told it also, oh, yes, I also told it that I wanted to also create a social media post, right? So it prompted me, here's the article, a title, and a social media post, all right? And so we're continuing the process. Well, now I decide I also want a 60, uh, 70 second video script, all right? So I tell it and I give it a topic and it starts generating this script. And I tell it, that's not what I wanted. I have to tell it again. <laughs> we have to have a conversation. I told it, you are not listening. The flow is. And so this is really important. To ask me for a topic, generate an SEO paragraph, then an SEO title, followed by a social media post, and then the script. Okay. So it gives me another one, another prompt, working from home. And so now I get the paragraph and this, and I get this, this uh, video script. And so again, I tell it, okay, great. I want to create, this is really important. So after you've done, and you've really got to kind of tweak the way that you want it, you tell it, you want to create a copy and paste set of instructions or prompt that I can paste and you will follow the guidelines. And it says, absolutely, and it gives me this, and I'm not too happy with this. And so I tell it, I want it, I want it organized to say chat GP instructions and written in a code block. And then I also said, I want to add another instruction, one additional line in the script that says something about check the description for more information. And so finally, we're down here and it gives us this nicely formatted in a code block. So at the end of all of your hard work, a couple of more prompts can get you this. Now, I will include the last two prompts and also uh, in the description and also a link to our AI newsletter where we have tips and tricks and mastering all kinds of different AI tools and even the option to take a couple of free courses on AI. So what I want to do now is I want to copy this and we want to go test it out. So I'm just going to open a new chat and I'm going to paste it in. And let's see what it does. All right, go ahead and provide me with a topic to write an SEO paragraph about. So uh, mm, let's see, let's find something interesting. Uh, modern health on the carnivore diet. Let's see what we get. Okay, so, all right, we're getting the paragraph the way that I want it. SEO, that looks pretty good. An engaging title. Unlocking the mysteries of carnivore diet, a modern health perspective. Okay, great. 
a social media post, a 60 second script, and it's generating here, and even reminds them that sign up for our newsletter to never miss an update for your modern health topics. <laughs> bye bye for now. So it has some character. Now, the one thing that's interesting is it did not ask me to prompt again, right? And so let's say I want, to, uh, actually, let's go back to our other side. Okay, I believe that's this one. Here it is. And say, I want to add another instruction. Once you have generated <laughs> generated the required content, please ask if there is another topic. One, um, add this to the instructions and provide a new code block with that added. All right, let's take a look at it. Let's see. All right, so now we've got a new set of instructions. Hopefully that was at six. And once you've generated the content, all right, great. So Chad has now generated a new line that says also, once again, once you've generated the required content, please ask again. I hope this has been beneficial. It is uh, prompt engineering is as much art as it is science. And it's really important to remember the key component, at least with chat GPT, is chat. If you like this content, please like, subscribe, and share. And like I said, in the description will be prompts, the uh, other information, the uh, newsletter, etc. Have a great day.